Hello everyone, this is Sterling, Monday's host for Witchcrafting, and today's project will be a stained glass lantern. So what you will need is a lantern, some liquid Fimo, two pieces of paper to draw your pattern on, some soft pastels, a sharp tool to scrape the pastels and cut the clay. You'll need black clay. And you'll need something pointy. And you can use an extruder with the tiny holes if you have one. If you don't, it's fine. You can still roll it. And what you need to do is take the glass out and make sure the glass is clean. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so the next step, um, you would take the black clay from the extruder, make some little noodles, and then you want to start tracing around your pattern. Okay, so once you finish laying out the clay, you want to take one of these tools and smooth out the little corners here so you have nice, clean, smooth lines. Okay, so your next step is to take the pastel um, and use the, sorry, use the razor and scrape it in there, and then you're going to take the pointy tool and mix so you get that red color to blend in there. You're going to choose each individual color until you're done and then once that's done you're going to bake in the oven and then you'll put the glass back inside the lantern and I'll show you then the finished results. Okay, so for the finished product, here it is. And I purposely did it so you can see the flowers in the back and the grass. I was going to do all four sides, but it was very tedious and I really did not feel like doing it. But I think it works out well. So that way, oops, so that way light still shines through the sides as well too, so... Tell me what you guys think. I'm actually going to light it up too before I end the video. We'll see how that looks. Hopefully. Ah, let's see. Hold on one second. I'm sorry. Alright. Then let's shut off the light. So there it is. Stained glass fairy lantern. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bless thee.